I am William Hopkins Jr. and I am a good dad because I never really knew, I, I mean, I knew my father, but he, I wanted to know more about him. So I made it my point that I shared my life with my kids, that they get to know me, know me personally, who I am and where I come from. My mom and dad divorced when I was probably in the sixth, seventh grade. So he wasn't there all the time. And so it was a void there that I really missed because I wanted him around me. I wanted to see him, you know. So I got divorced and so my kids were outside the home and, and I did all I could do to be there for them um, and uh, that they would, can say I wasn't a void or empty in their lives. What have my kids or grandchildren taught me? I guess what they have taught me is that uh, eventually they grow up to be men and women. And what you do and how you pour into their lives when they're little will reflect in how they grow up. Um, and my grandkids, that's a whole new ball game because you just want to spoil them and kiss them and take, and then send them back home. So, you know, raising grandkids are a little different because they do, you find that they do touch your heart in a way that your kids did it, but now they're grown. So, you like starting all over. When they're small, you, you're able to protect them and keep them, you know, under your wing. And then when they get older, they have to branch out and become their own man and woman. So when they get older and they're grown, you, you tend to be more concerned or worried per se. So you, have, you're, you don't have the control. So the favorite part about being a father or grandfather, when I would see my kids looking like me <laughs> and acting like me and, and like the things that I like. So we always look for ourselves and our children. My grandkids, I just know that they think I'm the best thing since sliced cake. So I love being around them and I love them. They be all over me and they, they love being with me. The, the, the love of a child is so pure and grandkids' love is so pure.